Hi guys, Case and Brad here from The Real Deal again and this week on episode 3 we want to talk to you about last month's sales. Yeah, it's been another fantastic month in real estate. The Dillian market is still going red hot, which is fantastic. So we've got some really good stats to go through uh, with you today. We yeah, sure do. Yeah, so the um, total sales was um, obviously well down compared to this this time last year, or April last year, sorry. April last year we had uh, 254 sales in Dunedin. This year that was down to 181, so you can see there's re still a real shortage of properties out on the market. On the other side is that the median house sales now is 350 compared to 315 last year. So it has gone up, the minimum number of sales has gone down, and also, what's the other thing that's a bonus this year, this, this month, mate? Well, also, it's quicker to sell your house. So not only are you getting more money for your house, you're selling in a faster time frame. So making it a fantastic time to put your house on the market. Definitely. So what we've been noticing is that on realestate.co and Trade Me, that the house numbers, the listing numbers are down. What does that mean, Brad? They're at a record low case. Um, they're not just down, they're at record lows. I don't think I've ever seen them this low. So what that means is, if you're deciding to sell, wanting to put your house on the market, you're going to get more activity, more buyers through your house, more competition means you're going to get a better price. We discussed this last week about, um, a couple of weeks ago, about listing your house in winter and the benefits, and we're definitely seeing those at the moment, aren't we? There is still huge demand out there. Lots of buyers are wanting to buy, but they just don't have the properties to look at. So if you are thinking about putting your house on the market, we highly recommend that you do. That's all we've got for you this week guys. If you have any questions, feel free to write in the comments section below and we'll try and get back to you next week. You've been watching The Real Deal with Case and Brad.